Hello once again everyone and welcome to Baldur's Gate 3 lore series. We got lots going on right now. Well, first of all, let me tell you something real quick. We are going towards Baldur's Gate, the city now. And I almost go through with it. And then I, for I remember that I forgot, basically, uh, a few things that we need to get going uh we need to get done before we continue uh but besides that just let me tell you a few things we still have the many many references and and encrypted talk about orpheus we need to get uh, information about that we need to get also investigating about the Dark Urge memories. Something else that we're going to get to see uh, in Act 3. It's all that it's about rescuing the Duke Grave. Uh, well, Will's father, basically. But I went to the camp and I saw Arabella and I then, then I was like, holy shit, we did not save her parents. If she's still in camp, it's because we haven't saved them. So, I believe... Well... Just as Roland, the other tiefling, they ventured into the Shadow Curse Lands. So, I'm not entirely sure... Two people taste different from one another when you feed. <laughs> ah, good question. All depends. A clean neck certainly helps. Come on. You know I'm talking about their blood. Of course. There are different vintages. Young Noble is wonderful if you can get it. But Crone has its charms too. It's a good thing I keep all the keys. One of them is still alive. The doctors found oblivion. Well, no time to mourn. I got no idea how we'll could that, that happened. happened. That's Arabella's father. Or was Arabella's father? Oh. Well, that is not good. They are both dead. Anyway, we got this. The corpse regards you lifelessly. Remind me, who are you? Where are you from? Why were you in this place? Betrayed. We came to learn that in previous episodes. How did you die? Well, that is no surprise. Now, uh, what happened? The corpse remains silent. It does not know. 
the spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. Mm, well, that is a bit bitter. And we can't do anything else. I figure as much. You foul creature. You sold. Well, that wasn't too nice. I was all fired up because we're going to the city. In any case, being sad and all, the next other thing we need to get is um, Roland, who was father to, or at least caretaker of, two of those uh, tieflings at the last light in, also went into the into the Shadow Curse lands. Those are the tieflings we found in the prison, by the way. Mm. We really did clean this place up, didn't we? Except for that thing that I could never pick up. In any case, I believe I know where he might have been. This is the toll house where we killed uh, the golden boss. Wait, hold on. Right. This letter of surrender I never saw. General Catholic Thorne. It is with heavy heart that I must announce the surrender of the Harper forces. Oh, the Harper surrendered to him. We never saw this. Two words are slashed across the bottom of the scroll. Surrender declined. It was some tough shit. No joke. But in the end... Is that Roland? I thought he had better what? sense than this. Where? I don't see him. Spill some blood. Where's Roland? I don't see him. Someone there. I'll be a challenge. Okay. Maybe it's not too bad. Cool. Very well, I don't know where Roland is. But anyway, as you can see, lads. Wait. I was gonna say, everything is done. But I'm not entirely sure now.
However, I show you all the secrets in this series, as you know. And I don't know if he didn't pass the check or so. Hmm. I believe it must be here. There it is. You know, I always show you the secret chests. In any case, those things should have been done. Oh, there it is. And those are the last two remaining things in this chapter of the series. And we will proceed with a lot already. Did you enjoy relaxing here while I battled that wretched darkness? What were you thinking? I'm sorry, we got captured by murderous lunatics! I thought you were dead, you ass! Both of you! We're all safe, Roland. That's what matters. He was in a bad state. Yeah. I was just overwhelmed. Doesn't matter. I'm sorry. We should have been here. No, no, it's it's not your fault. I, I, I shouldn't have shouted. I'm sorry. Thank you for saving me. And the two idiots. Humble too? Imagine that. She has no cause to be humble. She brought us back together. A task I failed miserably at. You went out of your way to help us. It's only right you get something in return. Here. I hope it helps. Oh. Wait, what, what did it give me? Uh, I don't... I don't see anything new. So there's that done. And I did not think this through, but it's going to be a little bit salty to end the chapter in such a sad note. Wait, where's the kid? It's not over there, and I always lost people. Ah, there it is. Oh, it's here. It's so small, and Withers is not there. Hey, you. Where is Withers? Easy peasy. You find Mum and Pops. What does it? What does happen if I just don't tell her that? No. No, no, no. I don't believe you. It isn't true. It isn't. Get away from me. Go. Well, leave me alone. Mission complete, I guess. That's not cool. We were going to to see some cool shit right off the back and we get to end like this. You saw Gortash, didn't you? What the fuck was he we doing did. down there? We did. Is all of this because of him? The tadpole, the absolute. How?
I don't know how these plots fit uh, fits together yet, but we will stop him. I was his bodyguard. I looked after him with my life. I trusted him more than anything. He gave me away to Zariel just for kicks. He ruined my life just when it was starting. And now he'll use up the entire Sword Coast. He has to die. And I'm gonna be the one who kills him. He can't get away with what he's done to me, to us. He won't get away with it. Some story right there. I you... wish we could stay and see what this place will be like without the shadows. I bet it's beautiful. No rest for the wicked, huh? Is there anything else you can tell me? He got his claws into me early. I was a wild kid. Brawling my way through the city. One of my mates got wind of a bit of work guarding some indoorsy type with lots of enemies seemed like easy money so i went in for it he took one look at me and said i was perfect i like that not like that you know just it felt like a good fit i kept him safe and he paid me well well enough to move into a better neighborhood and put something away for the future my future i respected him trusted him and he returned that trust, that respect. His life was in my hands, and I took that seriously. The whole thing with Zauriel happened so fast. I had no idea what had gone down until it was over. One minute I was in Baldur's Gate, a happy, healthy, not-quite-kid. The next, I was burning up in a Avernus with an engine for a heart. Zariel laughed said she paid him well for my services. She'd wanted to test her new machine, and he said I'd be able to handle it. He was right. Sometimes I wish he weren't. Evil, evil bastard. It's so intense, quite frankly. It's, it's pretty good. So there's that. And now we do go towards Baldur's Gate. And truth be told, sad things aside, just so I can speak plainly for a minute. Um, from this point forward, we everything that we've been doing in the series so far is going to be extremely enhanced. We're going to get to see a lot of things, to talk about a lot of things. And let me tell you, everything that I've been talking about with the builds and, and wanting to close and get all the full sets that I wanted... That's where we're going to finish that, because... Listen, the psionic detector. Githyanki are lurking nearby. Oh, that's true, we got that. Uh, but yeah, as I was saying... We get... Um, amazing items. In the way I plant it. It's going to be a good show. I don't know what's going to happen with Arabella. So, okay... I tell you the movie here. The Githyanki are around uh, around this area, <clears throat> preparing an ambush. So what I would try to do well is just try to get the closest I can. Okay, so no one else been. Been found. 
That's not bad. I, I tell you the movie. Mm. The guys with the crossbow are really annoying. Not as annoying as this one. But in any case, we should kill the crossbows uh, right away. These guys are going to come towards us and whatnot. But yeah, let's get it going. Let's just get it going because this is kind of annoying. It's not too bad. But still. So that guy's dead. Just take a peek. The Ethian are always loaded with stuff for us to sell. That's good. Um, I still got. Oh yeah, and remember, the Githyanki that are two-handed weapon, they are ready to parry. So you have to take that off first. Before... Can I use this? No. Before trying to attack melee. I won't give in. In, in truth, I should kill that one first. Mm. Let's see what we can do with... With shard. I don't know. Damn. That is not good. <laughs> and actually, well, might be able to. Push her, right? And she's dead. Now, let's put this on some of those. Survival is all that matters. Well. I'm gonna position myself here. Uh, and I probably should do the same here. Hmm. The axe wasn't close enough. Now these guys are gonna start coming towards us. Oh yeah, and just to mention uh, something else, my buddy, uh, my, my friend Brand, a few episodes ago was concerned about uh, me not really being thoughtful with um, all the lore and the story surrounding the Mind Flayers. And to that, I responded that it was going to be deeply addressed and we are not far away from that just letting you know also I would like to wish him the best on his trial <laughs> as you can see 200 githyanki are ready to parry good idea to take that off And because I use my actions, I do not have that. And as for shard, mm, I did use my spell, didn't I? Forever dauntless. I want to see the pet. This one, the cambion. Okay. 
so he's dead. Oh, weapon dropped. No, that's not good. Well, the axe needs to move. <laughs> Damn, that's bad. Let's have some fun. Wait, this guy's prone, but he's still alive. Hmm. Probably that. Need to stay focused. Use your mace. You should have used something else. Okay, so this is the path. Let's see. Rush attack. Charm. Just like the bite. Race of fire. Mm. Right. Battle favors the fearless. Gets prone pretty easily. Okay, he's dead now. Precisely, good thing we got that now. Especially with all that's going on with um forgot his name, but the one Githyanki Dragon Rider. If you don't remember, guys, he told us to meet him at the... Yo, Australian, pick that, pick that up, please. Uh, at Baldur's Gate. I forgot. It was this one on the right. And this one on the left, right? I don't even remember. But guys, that, oh, telekinesis, all right, Do what has been asked of you. Stop the interpol interlopers. Take back what is mine, else your punishment will be severe. Okay, so this guy is obviously sent by Blacketh. Stop me yet. The shadow curse will soon be forgotten thanks to us. That's pretty good. But as I was saying, oh, and w something else. We surely need to dismiss the uh, um the pet. Because people get scared, apparently. What? Ah, there we are. Defender of the people. As I was saying. That is it. We don't have anything else to do. And off we go to Baldur's Gate. Looks like an army marched through here. It's the army. It's going already. It's
it's going without Ketherick Thorn. That's interesting. But yeah, enough talk. Let's get it. I'm just gonna check around, see if anyone needs to talk. We're changing chapter at the moment. Which is... Oh, look at that. It's our Selunite friends. What do you know about me? You spoke of my past. Being chased by wolves. I told no one about that. Almost no one. But I certainly didn't share that with you. There is nothing I can tell you that you do not already know yourself. They trained you well, trained you hard. Chiseled away any part of you that did not fit their plan. They made you forget. I chose to do that. For the mission to protect Shaz... Secrets. Yes, yes, that is an old song, girl. Your goddess cares more for her precious secrets than she does her devotees. Get to the point. When you freed me, you severed a bond between me and that dog, Thorm. A bond of pain. His, inflicted on me. When I laid eyes on you, I sensed a similar bond. You, tethered to two others. Someplace distant. Let me help you remember. You feel Shadowheart's mind tug at the edges of your own. You know this sensation. She wants you to see whatever is about to be revealed. She wants me to see. That is very interesting. Your mind joins with Shadow Hearts. Something pulls at you both, bringing you elsewhere. Hence her fear of wolves. And these are Sharans. Fail the check. Who was that man? You already know. Did you not see yourself in him? Do you not recognize your own blood? My father. That was him. That is him. He lives still. And your mother, too. No. It can't be. I'm an orphan. And who told you that? Your adoptive family? You are not to blame. You were young, impressionable. They took you because they wanted to break and remake you. But you are a child no longer. You are a woman, one who knows what must be done. My parents, I need to save them. Right, so the religion check that we failed it would have said something along the lines of you remember that it is a common right among Seluna's followers to send their children off to the, into the woods to find their way home. Perhaps this time it had gone awry. It seems like one child never came back. She was taken. Referring to the fact that, um, well, the, the very same scene that you just saw. Your parents are with your abductors. You will need to return to their lair. But be warned. You may have once thought of them as comrades, mentors, friends, even lovers. They will all be enemies now. You have been forewarned for what is to come. But not yet forearmed. Spear of Night, I thought I was cast into the shadow fell. She did throw it away. I was able to retrieve it before it sank too far into Shah's umbral domain. 
Shar is quick to discard whatever she has no use for. I think you know that well enough. But I felt it call to me as I took flight. Whatever Shar calls her own, Saluna has equal claim to. They are one and the same. Their power is matched and mirrored. Take it. You will find it useful. What you do with it, that will be up to you. Same as before. I'll need every advantage, it seems. Thank you. A debt repaid. You returned my life unto me. Now go and claim your own. <coughs> it hurts. The one still... Shah torments you still. What a spiteful creature she is. This will not stop until you take action. See that your parents' sacrifices are not in vain. Allow the Moon Maiden to guide you at last. Teluna Spear of Night. This is pretty good. The good thing about it, it's actually the... Um, the Moonbeam. I don't know if I... If I could do it now to show you. Hmm. Moon mount. Moonbeam. It's a small circle in in the round. And if you step in it, you start to get damage, basically. I mean it's a good item. I'll see if we can do something with that. The one spear you get if you are, uh, if you go a different path, if you are bad, let's say, um, I think it's actually way better. But obviously, uh, we wouldn't do that. No one else needs to talk. Let's see about Arabella. She's still here. Leave me alone. She still does not want to talk. In any case, let's rest this time. I've been lied to my whole life and I was gullible enough to just believe it my parents are alive and I have to save them I think a part of me always knew that a part that Shah denied to me You've been forced to live a lie. At least now the truth is starting to reveal itself. And we will. Indeed. Let's. But the truth may yet prove painful. Who knows what Shah still keeps from me. We'd better press on for now. And hope we're ready when the moment comes. But before that, there's one thing I need to see to. Ah, what's that? You'll see for yourself soon enough. Just leave it with me. Very well. Matter of fact, we do need to uh, take Lysel now. It is as we knew. My people have turned their blades against us. They will emerge from the shadows and descend from the skies. And we will grant them their only just fate. Death. Shadowheart was no true child of Shah, merely a captive. She must have her vengeance. 
You're starting to like her, aren't you? It is done. Well, very provisional build. Again, didn't think much of it. But we just need her to be around. In any case, let's rest again, again. Or maybe not. The curse has been lifted. The land's cleansed of the shadows. Catherick's reign of living death is over. Your courage has been tested, and in this at least, you have triumphed. The armor looks so good. The curse is lifting. Sergeant, if you are here, I presume Wern's Rock is secure, and preparations for my inauguration are complete. No, Lord Gortash. We were interrupted. Another quake in the lower city. More severe this time. So you came cowering to my chambers? I'm flattered, Sergeant. But even I cannot command natural phenomena to cease. Forgive me, my lord, but there is panic in the streets. The people are afraid. Perhaps the people would be calm if you kept your nerve. I expect better from the flaming fist than to run scared from a slight tremor in the earth. Get back to your duties. Duties, duties, duties. Patrolling and saluting and following and bowing and scraping. Yes, sir. No, sir. Rip and cut your throat, sir. You gotta give it to her. That your was smooth. <laughs> Lordling, give me a reason not to cut you to ribbons. Control yourself, Orin. We need to focus on reuniting the stones or the brain will break free. These quakes are just the start. <laughs> Neither of us expected the prison bearers to kill Ketherick. They'll be traveling to the city. Let's make sure we give them a Baldurian welcome. My prodigal bloodkin is among them. They live? <laughs> Barely. I made mince of their ugly mind matter. And if they dare return, I will strip out their offer. Prodigal Bloodkin.
Beyond the campsite, the Look city at that. waits in uneasy silence, one sleep away. Would you look at that, lads? It is, in my humble opinion, and because it's my video and my channel, I will take it as the only right opinion and everyone else is dumb. The best city ever made in a video game. It's just absolutely fucking spectacular. This is coming together. I never thought. I, I didn't really think I would made it this far into into the series when I had the idea. Being completely honest, I thought I, I thought I was gonna quit the series before episode ten. So to all the people that comes and watch and clicks the like button just to support me, even when you don't like the game or you don't like the videos. I really, really appreciate it. The gate is closed. As is Casador. And we are no closer to knowing that. That is Forrest true. Is so obsessed with getting me back. Something else that awaits for us in the city. If you guys don't remember, Casador is the one that vampirized and enslaved Starion for well over 200 years. Tell you the truth, I don't know whether we can defeat Casador. Not unless we can figure out more about what he's plotting. I think we should track down my fellow Spawn. I'm not exactly looking forward to a reunion, but perhaps they'll know something. If we can find them, we can force them to tell us what he's been doing since I was gone. And honestly, I imagine they'll be coming for me in the night if I don't. Unless Cazadors change their orders, they'll be in the dens of this town, seeking prey. We should get to them first. And then we can make the pretty tongues talk. So, an innkeep, a tavern sort of thing. That is the, that is the little hints. It's given to us the armor, by the way. I cannot stop looking at Aileen's armor. Look at that. It's fucking spectacular. But yeah, once again, let's rest. Can we rest? Once and for all. I want to make it to the city, please. No one else uh, needs to talk, it seems. No? The events of the last days weigh heavily upon you. Since it's been rest a is slow to come to one whose mind is so full. It's been wild. It's been wild, the lads. is not a god, but an elder brain controlled by the chosen of the dead three. They mean to use it to take control of the Sword Coast. All who carry the Tadpole are governed by the brain and, by extension, the chosen. It will take but one order to transform them into an army of mind flayers. This would have been your fate too, were it not for the astral prism and the mysterious visitor inside of it. With her help, you have uncovered the cult for what it really is. A plan of conquest orchestrated by the gods of death themselves. Together, you have the power to thwart the dead three. If you follow this path to its end, the Elder Brain will not answer to the Chosen. It will answer to you. And what then? You are prone to impulses as uncontrollable as the gods themselves. Will you even have a say in what you do? No. Will you liberate the true souls from their parasites and their religious delusions? Or will you use the power you gain for your own purposes? No, lads. Absolutely not. We are a paladin. We've been fighting the Dark Urge. 
mind you, I remember you. Uh, besides that, we've done a few things. We killed Gale, basically. We killed Gale. We killed an innocent tiefling at the grove. We killed Alfira. We killed the cat. But the cat was pretty evil. But yeah. We do want to fight the dirge. You will not have long to wait. All you need to do now is sleep. But sleep is not for you. The absolute. The reckoning is upon us. The prism. The They're moving. Yes. We're under attack. Help me. Yes. Oh, look at that. Affected entity's brain is being tortured at the at the whim of the absolute. Oh. That is not good. Yeah, you can see they are not full HP. Escape to the portal before the absolute takes control. Right. Oh, you are kidding me, aren't you? Oh no, I do have the... Just moved. We do not use... We do not want to use this, by the way. Right, so we need to get moving. Remember what I told you before? The gift usually are well equipped. You can get a lot of loot from them. This one doesn't have anything. Right. Iron is near death. Fight your way to the portal. I need your help. This will help with the pain. Take you. Nothing will stand in my way. Very well. I do not have much movement and the path is blocked. I shouldn't have done it that way. Oh, they're coming out. It's more of them. For Orpheus. What are you on about? I can't do this without you. I'm trying. Mm. 
still on my feet. We need to move. Can I use it? There we are. Look at those gears. They do not look like the soldiers we've met. They look like monks. They don't have weapons. Run, lads. Wait, hold on. Keep your this guy cannot go like that. Where is the freaking... Right. Still alive, so Let's go. Worse. What? Wait, am I... Fighting the gears or the... What's hiding here? Yeah, my my What's team this? is stayed behind. Everyone else is staying. Well. So yeah, we are also fighting the Gith, although... It was here. I didn't see it. I didn't see her. Taste my fury. <laughs> so we need to have the dream visitor, lads. Never a dull moment. Everything is done here. Not too bad. Ready. And she also used it all. Oof. I shouldn't have used that. We are about to lose a Starion. Indeed, it did. Will do, will do. Hold on. Nothing hurts anymore. To the skull. It's not over. Come to the skull. A 
past the check there, I didn't see it. Whoa. Emperor. We are in danger. Geek abomination by the one true sky. What is this madness? The Gideon King is the source of our protection against the absolute. I must against the absolute. Or everything we've worked towards is lost. Don't let my form deceive you. I am the one. That's been protecting you. What? I am the one that came to you in your dreams. Help me. Oh. And it's the fucking song from when you create a character. <laughs> Thank you. 